Hey guys, welcome back to the Real Madrid career mode. This is episode 11, and today we're going to start off with a Spanish Cup game against Sevilla. Both episodes will be in, and we'll see if we advance. Look at that intro. Sevilla, I'm a big fan of Sevilla for some reason. Edison Cavani, the man, the myth, the legend right there. He's been playing absolutely fantastic for us ever since we signed him. So we get here early in the game. We a nice pass right to Tony Cruz, and it just gets blocked. Ah, block shots just piss me off, man. Now look at this play right here. Bale, absolute nightmare on the wing. So I'm, like, I'm going to run. I'm like, I should I should pass it right there, and it gets blocked. It's Ah, oh, block pass are just pissing me off so much. It's just I can't can't do anything about it. I can't I can't win, man. I can't win. Anyway, they get a, a, oh my God, they get a nice free kick. The ball just sitting there. I can't clear it, and it's just, I don't know. I There's been a gap between 10 and 11 of a couple you know, like four days and stuff, and then <laughs> look at that <laughs> stupid pass out of bounds. I'm a little bit rusty. Sometimes I'm playing really good in the past couple episodes, and sometimes I'm, I just get rusty, like I saw against here, against Sevilla. But we got Cristiano Ronaldo running down the left, cutting inside, trying to do something. Wow, we are in the 82nd minute, <laughs> and Cavani gets a shot in. There's nothing, nothing going on in this game, guys. 87th minute, we're coming out with Bale. We attacked very well. Once they started parking the bus, and we got a wide open header, and no one's open. But it falls right to Demarcos again, powered inside. Oh, falls right outside. That wasn't Demarcos, that was Kadira. My mistake. <coughs> Sammy Kadira had a chance to win the game for me. But anyway, we're back here with Demarcos, and we're going to fire it in to Chagalugalu. I will never get his name right, and it's going to get stolen from me. No, it is not. Wait a second, spoiler. Yes, it is. There's Demarcos coming and flying, and what an absolute terrible shot. Right to Bale, who heads it, and it goes straight down. What? Let's look at this instant replay. DeMarcos fires a ripping shot right to Bale. The, the deflection goes right to Bale and he heads it right on the ground. I don't understand how he didn't score that goal. Whatever. Anyway, <clears throat> sorry about the coughing. I was a little sick. We tie game. We have a game against Atletico Madrid who <laughs> Manzukic almost scored right there off the bat. Yeah, my voice is off. That's why I'm, I'm a little sick. <clears throat> It's okay, though. And then Bale with a horrible first touch. And it's, come on, man. We need something. Atletico Madrid is the type of team that I just haven't been able to beat for some reason in this career mode. They beat us in the um, opening, whatever it's called. And then they, they beat us right away for the second game against them. We just can't get a win. And right there, easy goal for them. They just tap it right in, and there's nothing I can do. I mean, I shouldn't play better defense. But Atletico Madrid has been a killer for me recently in this season. I hope to see them in some other competition, whether that be the Champions League or... The Spanish Cup, they're already eliminated in, but I want to get my revenge on them. <coughs> Excuse me again, guys. I don't want my voice is shitting out. But we do have a nice cross right here by uh, Rodriguez right into the box, but nothing can come of it. It's just, I thought Madrid is just a scrappy team, and they're just pissing me off so much. But, you know, every time I go in, I got destroyed there in the box, and I thought it was a penalty, but what are you going to do? After I looked at the replay, it looked pretty clean. But I'm going to fire it in with Ronaldo, and it gets blocked again. It's these blocked shots. I just... Uh, World-class is frustrating sometimes. But that's the game, folks. I lose Atletico Madrid. Pissing me off because they're in first and we were not. But we'll make up games. Now a second leg against Sevilla. They're wearing the red jerseys again because I quite fancy those jerseys. But here I'm making an attack with Bale right away. He was an absolute tear in this game on that wing. I'm going to, you know... Passed it into absolutely nobody. There was a guy there, but the center back got there first. I probably should have did a different cross again. But look at Bale just running down again, firing it in, looking for headers from Cavani, and a nice save by Beto. He got to that. But I don't have a lot of crossing goals, but man, Bale's just been awesome. Got a corner right to Tony Cruz, firing it in, and our guy falls down. <laughs> Looks like the goalie took him out, but nothing comes of it. Here we go, Sevilla on the attack. They weren't attacking as much this game as they were last game, but look at this right here. Look at that absolutely gorgeous pass, and they miss it. I played horrible defense, but that was a great, great pass. That should have been a goal. Even though Courtois probably would have saved it if they didn't shoot it so terribly. And we're on the run again, and Bale's just been an absolute terror. I'm, like, I'm going to shoot this time, and off the freaking post. Beats the goalie, goes off the post. I can't buy a goal this game. I am seriously have no luck whatsoever. Look at this pass. Right to Iramendi. Right to Cristiano Ronaldo. And I'm going to take one touch and it gets stolen from me. I'm an idiot for taking that touch. I'm Cristiano Ronaldo. I'm in the box. Fire that home. It's going to be a goal. 9 out of 10 times. Probably 10 out of 10 times. So I'm going to do some subs because I can get nothing going. I cannot get a goal this game. You know. Uh, put DeMarcus in for Danilo because he's tired. I put Modric in at center defensive mid. And I was thinking about should I put one more sub and should I put Chagunugulugulug in 
and I just decided against it. I got a nice run with Ronaldo, and I just, you know, Beto's been a good goalie. He's saved a lot of my shots. That was a bad angle for Ronaldo, and I was hoping to get a corner out of it, but what are you going to do? I'm trying to go one last attack right here. Cavani running around trying to make someone turn some guy, and I get a fire. And I do get a shot against Beto, but he just saves it again, and that's pretty much the first 90 minutes extra time. It's coming up in the Spanish Cup. I still got one more sub left. I'm going to put Chaganuglu in, the Turkish, at Cam for Tony Cruz. Hopefully he can make a difference for me in this extra time period. So here we go. And right away, we get a pretty good defensive stop from DeMarco. So I'm just going to fire this pass right down there. I don't know what it's going to do. Chaganuglu is running, and Bethel's running. I'm like, God, Bethel. And he stops. Bethel, for some reason, stops. We're going to shoot it, and it goes in. I was so surprised that that went in. Chaganuglu. Makes an absolute great goal because Beto's like, I'm going to get this ball. You know what? Just kidding. And there's a wide open goal. He didn't even try to dive and get in my way. He did absolutely nothing. They said goalkeepers were fixed in this game or improved for FIFA 15. Watching that replay over and over again, I don't see any goal in like improved goalkeeping. I don't see a goalkeeper fix. I see Beto who played an absolute gem of a game. He played amazing. Just make an absolutely dumb mistake. Which is too bad for Beto, but we gotta take that dub where we can. Okay, Chad Nugu making another run, gonna fire it out right out of bounds. He was definitely a difference maker. We're in the 120th minute, nothing really happened. Just pretty much waiting for the game to be over. And um, I can tell Sevilla was tired because they did this. Right to, right to Cavani, I'm gonna score a goal, and I get taken down in the box. I'm getting the penalty. And um, that was a great steal. I'm like, should I put Cavani in? He did all the effort to take the penalty shot, but like, no, I'll keep Ronaldo in. I don't wanna accidentally miss a penalty or anything like that. Even though this this is stupid, I probably should have done whatever because it's game over pretty much. And Ronaldo's going to fire it in to, to the left. I need to work on my penalties. I need to get him to the left more or the right more because I feel like I don't... I put power is finally a little bit more power, but I need to push it over. Anyway, that ends the game. We should be playing Barcelona in the Spanish Cup final. I assume they're going to beat Valencia. Now we're going to do the last game of the episode against Deportivo. Let's get it going. Look at the ball up here. We got uh, Tony Cruz, you know, doing what Tony Cruz does. And look at that. He's, oh, and right to Chagunuglu. Right to Tony Cruz. He's going to get the first goal of the season. I think. I don't know if he scored. He probably has. I haven't played this crew in a long time recently, but they get saved. Thibaut Courtois. Courtois. Gonna fire it up. And it gets bounced around. And I'm like, I got this. No. Guess what? I don't got this. I need to work on my defense, guys. Because look at this, like, this passing. You know, the CPU has a nice passing in world class. Deepa Thibaut's probably not good of a team. Like, I got this guy. Look at And. How does that get through? My defender was literally right there. I don't understand. Look at this. It was a great pass, but my defender should have made the made the tackle. Don't let Touche score. Jesus. Nothing really going on in this game, guys. Fast forward to the second half where they get a pretty scary free kick, but we do end up getting clear. But the ball is in front of Courtois for a little bit, which is quite indeed scary. Fast forward to the 73rd minute, and Cavani's running pretty much doing nothing. I don't know what I was trying to do there, but... We're going to get fired. I ended up firing a shot with Cavani where it just gets deflected. Of course it gets deflected. Why do I get deflected? Because it always gets deflected. <laughs> Fast forward to the 88th, 86th. I can't really see the small screen minute. Cavani turns to the defender and they shoot in the back of the net and goal. I mean, he, does that sound familiar? Cavani turns to the defender. It seems like he does that a lot lately. He absolutely saved us of dropping two points instead of three in this game. We get a nice goal from Cavani when he turned that defender. and It's just he's been brilliant for us. I just can't. To say enough about him. I love Cavani. He was a great signing. Probably one of my best signings in this career mode. Should have made it from the start. He has four goals in La Liga, and it's just gonna. Oh, that's three goals in La Liga, and um, he's just gonna keep growing. Ronaldo, we're gonna have a chance to win this game right here. Cristiano Ronaldo's gonna come outside. I'm gonna pass it and get deflected around. Falls right to Alexandra, who's gonna get it stolen. That's pretty much the game, guys. We are currently fourth. But we are three games played behind Atletico Madrid and Barcelona and two behind Sevilla. So even though we're down in points, we still have plenty of games to make up. We have to see a Man City in the next game. And it was Barcelona in the Spanish Cup finale. It's going to be fun. Until next time, guys. See ya.